Okay, guys, um, this is my review for UFC um, Live. It was on Versus tonight. Um, Jones versus um, Latimer um, and Shinko. Um, let's first start off with Tyson Griffin versus Gomi. Um, I was wrong on this one. Gomi came out and, um, you know, did what he what he used to do in Japan and came out throwing the hands. And I, he caught uh, Tyson Griffin cleanly on the chin. Uh, with that big power right that he uh, always throws. And, um, you know, he, he caught him and, and knocked him out clean. Um, Griffin fell straight flat face onto the mat. So, um, congrats, Gomi. Um, he actually came through and won this one. I'm still not convinced that he's going to go through and dominate the division. But, you know, I, I was completely wrong on this one. Um, now let's move on to John Howard versus Jake Ellenberg. Um, Jake Ellenberg wins this one due to um, TKO stoppage, Dr. Stoppage. <coughs> Excuse me. Um, did you see the eye on John Howard? Um, his eye w looked like he had a grapefruit on it. You know, I mean, it was just his eye was closed shut. There was no way. You know, I know the, the fighter's heart. He wants to continue to fight. But this guy's eye, if he would have busted that open, it would have been gruesome. Um, the swelling on his eye was just completely horrid. But anyway, uh, Jake Ellenberg wins that one. Um, let's move on to Mark Munez versus uh, Okami. Um, Okami wins by uh, split decision. It was a pretty back and forth fight. Um, each one of them getting you know one of those you know um, knockdown punches and whatnot. So um, Okami wins by split decision, like I said. Um, now we go to the main event, which is John Jones versus Vladimir Menchenko. Um, John Jones just demolished Vladimir. He just wiped the floor with him. You know, he was doing what he normally does, kicks, um, you know, his, his funny kicks, swinging, you know, the, the kicks that you see in the movies and all of a sudden the elbows. And then he goes and does the judo throw on the ground, takes Latimer down, um, pretty much, you know, pins his arm underneath one arm. I mean, pins Latimer's arm underneath his leg, um, pins it down, and then it's all elbows all the way from the top. And they were clean, straight, you know, come down from like an axe slicing Latimer's face. Um... And, and then it was stopped. The fight was stopped due to elbows. Um, he, really do, he really does need to, to go up. I'm telling you guys, this, this um, John Jones, if, if Anderson Silva was dead, uh, John Jones would be his reincarnation. You know, these guys fight so similar. It, 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 it's, a, it's amazing. Um, I, I, I would love to see them two fight. You know, maybe a little bit too early to say to, to say that, but I really do feel that way. This guy has so much potential; it's insane. Um, so I would really, really like to see him go up into that top, um, you know, the top, the top um, ten light heavyweights um, to get in there to fight. Maybe a Forrest Griffin or fight, you know, just to get get, get in there with the with the with the doorkeeper. You know, go in there and, and get into that excellent. Um, um, the excellent competition up in the you know in the light heavyweights because there's so much of it in in the light heavyweight division. But anyway, guys, um, that was my review for uh, UFC um, versus live uh, John Jones versus Vladimir Menchenko. Uh, I'm gonna do a review uh, a preview over the um, Anderson Silva and Shell Sonnen fight coming up UFC 117. Um, so check that check out for that video. If you like this video, please rate subscribe. And, uh, and comment if you liked it. Uh, see you guys next time. Thanks.